Howdy. Welcome back to Underwater Math. My name is Farmer Willie and this is my pig named Petunia. Today, we're back on the farm. We'll be building our skills on perimeter and area, and learn more about the relationship between the two. As we've learned, rectangles can have the same perimeter but different areas as other rectangles, or the same area but different perimeters. That's right. The dimensions of the shape decide the area and perimeter. The area is the space inside of a shape and the perimeter is the distance around the shape. We measure the length and width to find both area and perimeter. The formula for perimeter is length plus length plus width plus width. And the formula for area is length times width. Let's look at this first rectangle. It has a width of 2 units and a length of 4 units. To find the perimeter, we would add 2 plus 2 plus 4 plus 4, which equals 12 units. To find the area, we'd multiply 2 times 4, which equals 8 square units. Which of these other rectangles has the same perimeter Farmer Willy? I'll add the lengths and widths in my head quickly. Okay. Rectangle A has a perimeter of 14 units, Rectangle B has a perimeter of 10 units, and Rectangle C has a perimeter of 12 units. Rectangle C has the same perimeter of 12 units, but an area of 5 square units. Strange, but interesting. Yes, it is. You just really have to make sure that you remember the formulas to find either the area or perimeter and not get confused between the two. Let's do one more. This time we want to find a rectangle with the same area, but with a different perimeter as the model shown. The width is 2 units and the length is 4 units, so the area is 8 squared units. What are the other factors of 8? 1 times 8. Would a 1 by 8 rectangle have the same area as the model, but a different perimeter? Let's find the perimeter to make sure. Yup, this rectangle would have an area of 8 squared units, but a perimeter of 18 units. Great job Petunia! Thanks! This was fun. Area and perimeter aren't as hard as they look if we keep practicing. Indeed. Thanks for joining us today to build our skills. Remember your formulas.